In the 80s and 90s, the more bits your machine had, usually the more capable it was. We started off with the 8-bit machines, then came along the more capable 16-bit machines, and things got a whole lot more powerful. As we stood on the cusp of the 32-bit era, with the first 32-bit machines starting to be released, Atari launched its new console and told the world it was 64 bits. Yes, Atari challenged us all to do the maths. You could see why Atari wanted us all to think that its new console was 64-bit. It implied that it was far more powerful than the up-and-coming 32-bit consoles. There was, however, a small wrinkle in the otherwise cunning marketing plan that Atari had come up with, because there was a chance that the Jaguar wasn't 64-bit. Soon in playgrounds across the planet, the debate raged, was the Jaguar 64-bit or not? Well, in a move that will be in no way controversial, I expect like zero negative comments below, we're going to answer that question. Is the Jaguar 64-bit? No. No, it's not.